Where would you like me to take you, Agent Crawler? I want to go to the campfire area. Mm. You look so cute in that janitor outfit. Where would you like me to take you, Agent Crawler? Drop me outside the main lodge. Oh, bring me back a burger this time, will you? Warning. Geodesic psycho-isolation chamber this way. This way to the main lodge. Hey, anything new in the store? Take a look. Whoa, that's my last cobweb duster. Take that into someone's mind. Hey, can you put that on you my can tab? Clean. Ah, sorry, Mac. No can do. We only trade in hard, cold, satinium arrowheads here. If you don't have enough, why don't you run around outside a bit and dig some up? Or crack open some mental vaults. Always something valuable in a vault. Mmm, dream. Now, you take that side core there. It. Alrighty then. What else can I do you for? I'll take it. Sold to the big headed kid with the gloves. What else can I do you for? Now, that's you it take for that now. Side. All right, go get more airheads and come on back. <laughs> yep. Yep. Great shot. Well, partner, it weren't great, but it weren't bad neither. Can't get a good grip. Oblongata. You have a water phobia? <gasps> Me too! Huh? No. Well, yes. I just... My family has this problem with water. It's a bunch of hooey anyway. 
Some old gypsy curse about how we're all supposed to die in water. If you can believe that. Oh! I thought it was about the whole thing with the brain-eating fish that walks out of the lake at night to hunt for victims. Well, see ya! Um, hey Raz, I saw you and Lily talking in the coach's class, and I was wondering, were you asking her to go with you? What? No! I'm here to train. No distractions. Excellent! Bye! that we are having a party out here on the floating dock and I'd love for you all to come. It's levitation training, baby, and it's fun, fun, fun. Just grab a canoe and come join the party. Those weeks in the canoe simulator really paid off. Uh, yes, sir, Admiral, sir. Well, let's get you afloat. Finest of the fleet. I'll take good care of her, sir. That lake isn't as peaceful or as harmless as she looks. <laughs> now, don't take her out too far. What's that round thing up on the dock? That thing? Oh, man. Let me tell you about that thing. That thing is none of your stinking business. <laughs> hey! Oh no, you don't. Dogen, are you okay? I had the strangest machine-induced dream about you. TV? Well, first of all, Sasha Nine invited me down to his secret lab, and... TV? He's completely brainless. The dream was true. Dogen, don't worry. I know where your brains are. They're in... Like this crazy dream thorn bush straight jacket tower place. Aggy sack. You go to the TV lounge. I'm on the case. I just need a little more advanced training to prepare. Yep. Don't be late. Levitation class has already begun. Come on out to the floating dock before the party is over. Mm. Hey, Elton, have you heard anything else about that thing in the lake? Huh? Oh, not really. The fish are kind of going crazy about Bobby and Benny over there torturing anything that swims too close. Oh, somebody should do something. Yeah. Well, I suppose I could go talk to them. Really? In Bull. He didn't show up for. Yep. <laughs> hey! Good! 
What are the chances that if I ask nicely, you two will stop messing with those poor fish? About as good as the chance that if you say one more freaking word to me about fish, the fire department's gonna have the jaws of life, my fist, out of your mouth! So wait, does that mean you will? I will punch you. That's what that means. I am the hideous, hulking lungfish of Lake Oblongata. I can breathe air and love to eat the brains of little boys. Don't make me. Hey! <laughs> I ain't afraid of no lungfish. Come on and get me, stupid lungfish. Look at me. I can breathe. Big deal. So can I. Having trouble finding those really deep, valuable arrowheads? Well, I've got a great deal on a slightly used dowsing rod up here in the main store that will practically dig them up for ya. There you are, darling. Don't worry, I got in contact with your father and he's going to be here tomorrow to pick you up. My father? Oh, gotta go. The race is starting. Lily! Oh, hey, Raz. Listen, I made you something. It's kind of stupid, but... They stole Dogen's brains! No, he's just like that. I had a nightmare where this mad scientist guy said he was going to take them out, and... Was it a creepy-looking freak with a shower cap and a stainless steel three-pronged claw? Hey, that's my nightmare. So it's not just me. But how? And why all the meat? I don't know. But I think it's time I find out where this is coming from. Let's rendezvous tonight at the old boathouse for debriefing. This is so cool! Yeah! It feels like that time in True Psychic Tales 314 where... Shut up! Agent Vodello? I have been ordered to report here for levitation training. I've already done the coach's obstacle course, and Sasha showed me how to shoot. You know, I'd expect that sort of recklessness from Orso, but Sasha? Agent Nine said you were the most powerful levitator the Psychonauts had. Sasha said that? Really? I didn't know he noticed. Well, you know, I only work with the best teachers. Flirt! Okay, let's party. the scene. Agent Vodello? Where are you? On TV, of course. Where I was always meant to be. I mean, look at my hair, darling. How can hair this fabulous not be on TV? Now, darling, the best way to learn levitation is to just try it. I'm going to give you a levitation learner's permit. It will only work while you're in my mind. After you finish my course, I'll give you the real thing, baby. First, you gotta show me you know how to use it. Now, bounce 
sun up here and follow me, darling. Now for this last one, you're really gonna have to fly. Once you get up in the air, try using your thoughts as a balloon to float. Just jump for those wings as high as you can and then do your side float. Don't be afraid, darling. Okay, now, just between you and me, this end of the party is dead. Come find me on the other side of the party, and I'll give you that merit badge for real. Never keep a girl waiting long, young man. Stay on the ball in here, Rasputin, if you want to get higher. And see if you can get all those rings spinning, Mr. DJ. Just follow the flowers, won't you? And try to stay rolling at all times. That is the theme of this party. But it will let you down nice and slow.
I feel so much better now. Come on, let's take it a little higher now. Ooh, look at the crowd. Things are starting to pick up. See that draft up above, darling? Jump into it and float and see where it takes you. But no dance. thanks, Raz. Hey, sure! We're all dancing!
you are levitating, you are also protected from all sorts of icky things. But some things, like those spikes, those are always bad news, whether you are levitating or not. So watch out! happening. Darling, do you have some problems with water? Do you want to talk about it? Uh, it's a long story. Maybe later. Okay, I'm always here for you, darling. Let me just say that it's very normal for boys your age.
quick like greasy lightning. I'm so proud of you, darling. You're so fast, you'll be at my party in no time, eh? Okay, if you want to get up to where the action is, you're going to have to do a lot of floating in this room, baby. Good thing you're so light on your feet. in some areas, you might get a little more oomph than usual. in some areas, you might get a little more oomph than usual. use your side float again to get those rings spinning.
Beauty. It's Ross Putin, the rolling rock star in the flesh. And just in time, the party was dying without you, darling. Here, I have a little party favor for you. Stranger, darling. Thank you, Agent Vodello. Now it's back to the lab to save Dogen. Dogen's not in the lab, sweetie. He's watching TV in the lodge with the other children. I meant the dream Dogen from my brain tumbler vision. If I can find out what's happening to him, maybe that would give me a clue about who stole real Dogen's brain. Oh, I'm afraid he's just like that. 